today's marketplace, creativity and content are king. No one knows that better than media service agencies, which in recent years have been at the forefront of creating new content forms to help deliver their clients' commercial messages. David Lang, President, Mindshare Entertainment, will share with us how to break the mold and look at new models for branded entertainment. Please welcome on stage David and his co-presenter, Laura Clauberg, VP of Global Media Unilever. Thank you all very much. Today we're going to talk about In the Motherhood. It's a project that Mindshare Entertainment created for Unilever, Suave specifically, and for Sprint. Now, Anita Newton from Sprint was supposed to be here, but she had some unforeseen last-second uh, issues, so she sends her apologies. But Laura and I will carry on. Now, In the Motherhood, we are happy and very proud to say, is the first-ever branded entertainment project that has now crossed over into television. Recently, ABC, the U.S. broadcaster, has optioned it for prime time, and we are currently in development. Now, before we get into the details of the who, what, when, where, why, and how of In the Motherhood, let's take a look at a little clip. I am so sorry. That top really goes with your hair. Is Heather in there? Oh, I'm out of here. She'll get tired soon. You know what? I better go too. Hi, we're camping too. <laughs> Who are you talking to? <gasps> okay, so I moved a family from New Jersey. At least someone got to see my ACDC tattoo. Mommy, no! Motherhood is an immersive entertainment experience. These types of branded entertainment projects have really gained in popularity and necessity due to a massive shift in the way people consume media and entertainment. Now, before we get to In the Motherhood, Laura, let's talk about that a little bit on a conceptual basis. As a marketer, huge difference in the way people are behaving. So how do you as a marketer address that in trying to reach and engage your consumers? Sure. So... I probably don't have to tell this audience because I think you probably all know uh, the statistics way better than I do, but there's been a massive shift in the media landscape, and it's really caused us to think as marketers to really rethink how we reach our consumers. So while t TV is really the model that our business was built on, it still by far you know, represents the lion's share of sort of media choices for our business. But we've realized that we really need to think about, A, TV differently, so how do we operate within the TV, traditional TV model? And then B, really playing to what's happening in the landscape with consumers really wanting to have a voice. How do we really tap into that voice and how do we engage them in ways that were really never available to us even just like five years ago? So what you really are talking about is we all have to look at things very, very differently. And I think one of the most important things that we found is relevant contextual content is huge in trying to reach and engage consumers. So in moving forward, the necessary ingredients in trying to create one of these projects, projects is it's not just about the big idea. Clients, and we talk about this all the time, they always ask for the big idea. But what's also just as important is flawless execution and multi-platform targeted distribution based on strategy and based on insights. 
And obviously, nothing would happen without forward-thinking clients like Laura and Unilever and Sprint, because without those clients, nothing gets done at all. Going back to In the Motherhood now, on the surface, Unilever and Sprint, leading CPG, cellular carrier, not much in common. So why the marriage? And Laura, let's talk about, from your position, what Suave brought to the table and why it worked for you. Sure. So Suave, and like many of our brands, is a brand that speaks to a mom's target. And from an insight standpoint, we know so much about what moms feel, how they feel about beauty, what their wants are, what their needs are, what their desires are, and how they kind of struggle with that constant tug between motherhood, doing something for me versus doing something for my children. And we know that children always come before mom. So that's like sort of at the foundation and at the heart of what that brand's about in terms of trying to give her beauty products that are reasonably priced so she doesn't have to feel guilty about taking care of herself. So that's an insight that we had. And the way this sort of project came together is that we were really looking for a project that we could own that would really speak to moms in a very unique and compelling way. And with the partnership uh, with Sprint, was really brought to us through Mindshare Entertainment, which was a really great marriage because Sprint was trying to reach moms as well, coming at it really from a different angle, but moms in terms of being in charge of the household and using the phone as a device to help manage their household. 